What's up guys, here is Claudio from Visual Modo WordPress Teams and in today's video you're gonna be learning how to use the alert message component of our polling WordPress plugin, the free WP Bakery page builder add-on plugin. So this is the polling demonstrative page website and this is how the element can look like. First of all, I'm gonna be leaving a link in the description below and a card over here for a video tutorial where I do explain how to download and install the Pollen WordPress plugin, the best WP Bakery add-on, completely free on WordPress.org. And now let's have a look at the alert page into the demonstrative website. Now we're gonna create ours. So, we're gonna move to WP Dashboard Page, Add New. We're gonna be using the backend editor, the classic mode, but you can also you edit it in the front end. Just click on Add Elements button, and inside your Add Elements tabs, you're gonna find the pollen components, and the very first one is the Ailer. So, first of all, you need to select the Ailer type. For example, the success. Now, you're gonna write a message that can appear on your, with your, inside your Ailer message. Let's save change so we can have a look. Before I test the page, I'm gonna be adding some padding top and padding bottom into the raw where the alert component is located, and this is what we have. This component it's really useful in the case that you want to display some message across your site, something like maintenance or shop messages, for example. In addition, you can apply the close bottom into the alert message so people can click on the close button and make the message disappear and now let's check every single one of the alert message types in addition you can apply an awesome CSS effect to the alert message and I'm gonna be leaving a link in the description below and a card over here for a video tutorial where I do explain how to use the awesome CSS effects animations that can appear while your components loading into the Pauling WordPress plugin. Now, let me just change the message. This is the option. This is the actual options that you have, but don't worry, our developer team is always adding more and more options for every single element. And now, just to a matter of organization, we're going to be adding some empty space so I can separate the components. And I'm going to apply this into a row with a column offset so it can occupy less space into the page for example this one let me just drag and drop the elements to the middle column and we are done I hope you guys enjoyed this video feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question, and don't forget to check out the visualmodo.com portfolio of amazing WordPress themes and also plugins. In addition, don't forget to download the Pauling WordPress plugin, it's free and ready for you. And I see you later! All the best!